creates a triangular hole, like a keyhole. It's a triangular hole, like a keyhole. Some kind of giant crab. It sounds like the poor thing's in a lot of pain. Yeah, the shell does look way too tight. Maybe he's outgrown it but can't shed it. Or whatever it's called. fireplace. Hello?
Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Quaman? I'm Amy Ryan. And me be Quaman. But what you be doing up in the air, big woman? Big woman? Watch it, I don't... Oh, I see. It's just my voice that's big, Quaman. I'm really quite average, size-wise. Could you please stop snoring? Quaman be snoring? No one ever tell Quaman he be snoring. But then Quaman always be sleeping by his lonesome. No woman like Quaman. Don't say that about yourself, Quaman. I'm sure that... You know? It's kind of uncomfortable to be discussing this in a moment like this. Yes, everyone be hearing about Quaman now. Where are you, Quaman? That be a secret. Quaman want to be left alone. What be the point? I'm a good listener, and I'd like to be your friend. That'd be the point. Quaman, not sure if he want friend now. Please let me be your friend. Why? Well, Kwama be wanting to help, but... Okay, Kwama be your friend and talk to you. My secret place be in the ruins of the old temple by the wells. Follow the stream up from the rock beach and go right where it branches. Thanks, Kwama. I'll get as soon as I can. That's Quammon, the not so quiet giant. Big. You're just about the biggest person I've ever met. Quaman be a freak. No one be liking him. I didn't mean it that way. I just meant... April, you know just what to say, don't you? I'm sorry. I like tall guys. Really, I do. You be the only one, then. Because no one else want anything to do with Quaman. you come to be on this island? That be a long story. Do you want Quaman to be telling you? Sure I have time. Tell me the story. Many long moons ago, Quaman be happy. He be working at the Circa in Khorasan, where he be big attraction. What did you do? 
Quaman be the world's strongest man. He be popular. People come to see him from all the Northlands. Some even from east of the Bay of Fire. But then there be an accident. And the circuit tell Quaman to leave. That he be dangerous. And that no one be paying to see him anymore. What kind of accident? Quaman's most popular feat be the breaking of large rocks with his fist. Everyone would applaud when the rock be breaking. Then one day, the Caliph be at the Circa to see the performers. He be saying, Quaman, I hear of him breaking a large rock with his fist. This I want to see. But my performance be over that day, and there be no rock to break. So the Circa Ringmaster Obron, he be saying, let's get a rock in here, any big rock at all. So they bring in this rock that Kwama never be crushing before. Kwama not be sure if it is a good idea, because rock can be dangerous when it breaks. But Obron be saying, this you must do. The Caliph wants to see. We do not disappoint the Caliph of Khorasan, or we lose our heads. So Kwama break the rock, and when it breaks... What, what happened? There'll be large pieces of rock flying everywhere, and one piece be hitting the Caliph and one his son. The Caliph be not seriously hurt, but his son be unconscious and bleeding from the head. They say to Quaman, Run! Get away from the Circa and Khorasan, or the Caliph will have his head. So Quaman run, and he get passage on ship leaving that night. When the ship passed this island, Quaman be jumping into sea and swimming ashore. And now he be here. What happened between you and the Orlawal? Oh, Quaman be so clumsy, so dangerous. He should not be among people. He be only hurting them. The Orlawal be kind, letting Quaman live and fish in their village. But then Quaman be stepping over young Orlawal, almost breaking his shell. The Orlawal tell Quaman to leave village, to not come back because he may kill an Orlawal. They tell him to go as far away as possible. Quaman be sad because he liked the Olawal and because Quaman be having the best fishing place in all of Elias. He loses his friends and his food. What do you eat now? Quaman fish in these wells here, but the fish that live down there be small and not very tasty. Would you like to move back to the Orlawal village? Oh yes. Quaman be wishing that more than anything in the world. I saw an Orlawal down by the beach, just outside the village. It seemed to be in pain, but I didn't know what to do. Perhaps if you come along, you can help him out, and get back in favor with the Orlawal people. Yes, perhaps Quaman can help. Even if the Orlawal do not want him back. Here it is, the, uh, Orlawal? Can you help it? Perhaps Quaman can help. Poor Orlawal. He'd be crying for help. Uh, Quaman see what be wrong. The Orlawal not shed its shell when time come, and now it be stuck in the shell. Why didn't the other Orlawal come to its assistance? Their claws be no good for this work. They be helpless. But Quaman help. Quaman be good with his hands. Quaman be happy. Quaman accept your graceful thanks, sir. Thank you.
you be making Quaman very happy. Quaman accept your offer and be grateful to the All Wall people. Thank you very much. What? What did he say? Why did you thank him? All Wall be inviting Quaman to stay on the cliff above the village where he can fish again. Quaman be very very happy now. You understand what it's saying? All the wall language be easy to understand. It be just click and clack and clock. I'm so happy for you, Guaman. Go on, don't let me hold you back. Quaman, how's the fish biting? With its teeth? But not today. Why is that? Quaman be not certain. The fish always bite before. But then Quaman be having lure. Now no lure, just bait. What do you need to make a lure? Quaman can make lure with just anything as long as it be colorful and not get heavy in water. You're a real DIY guy, don't you know? Always be something wrong with Quaman. That was actually a compliment. Oh. Happy fishing. Thank you. this wrapper work as a lure? Yes. Yes, with some work. It'd be perfect for a lure. Now Quaman can make one, and hopefully catch many fish. Hello, Quaman. Hello, April. Are you happy now, Quaman? Quaman be happy. He be wanting fish to bite. But if they do not, Quaman still be happy. Can I borrow your fishing rod? Quaman must catch fish first, so he can eat. After Quaman catch fish, April can borrow fishing rod. Happy fishing. Thank you. I'll see you guys later then. If you don't step on us first. It's a big wooden crossbow, I guess. I wonder who built it and what it's for. If I could somehow get across to that path on the other side, I'd probably be able to make my way into the Alation village. Who built that big crossbow in the tree? I did. Well, I thought of it. And these two nincompoops gave a helping twig on the, uh, manual side. <laughs> So they built it, and you... supervised? Yep. But it's not done. 
there are still a few pieces missing before we can blast off for Luna. Did you say blast off for Luna? That's what I said, Luna. As in the moon? The same. You intend to go to the moon using that thing? Lunar cannon. And yes, that's the plan. You guys are loonies! If by loonies you mean visionaries, then yes, yes we are. How come you're not working on your lunar cannon now? Because of that infernal noise is why! But Kwaman has moved back to the Orlowal village. He's not going to disturb you again, trust me. Really? How the heck did that happen? Nah, I don't care. The important thing is, we can work again. Thanks, lady. How's it going? Almost there. Oh, uh, one tiny little problem, though. And that is? We don't have a bowstring for our... Uh, uh... Propulsion drive mechanism, Wick. Uh, what he said, uh, yeah, we need a bowstring. Uh, something strong and flexible and sinewy. Like what? I don't know, lady. I'm no engineer. I'm just a supervisor. String made from animal guts would be perfect. Yeah, but look at us. Do we look like the kind of stick men who'd make good hunters? Do you see me going after a gaint beast carrying what? A cone? A dry leaf sharpened to a razor edge? Orlowal village. I look like a real sailor. Arr, Mikey. I don't figure I'll be needing the rod anytime soon, but I'll borrow the line. Did my Laura work okay? It'd be working very good. Quaman catch a large, tasty fish very quickly. April be wanting a taste? Uh, no. No offense. I'm just not too fond of seafood. This not be seafood. It be human food. What's Quaman gonna be doing now? Kwaman be sitting here until the sun sets. Then he be going to sleep. And tomorrow? Kwaman be deciding that when he wakes up in the morning. Man, you got relaxing down to a fine art. Kwaman not be knowing anything about fine art. He be a Philistine. I'll see you later, Kwaman. So will I.
Goodbye. Can you use this as bowstring for your, uh, lunar cannon? Let me see that. Oh, yeah, that gonna work good. All right, listen up. I got us what we need. And now we finish this damn cannon. Go to work, people. Give us a few minutes, lady, and we'll be all done. It worked, you wood-brained fool! I built it! Are you done? Yes, ma'am. The lunar cannon is now ready to be tested. Well? Well what? Are you gonna do it? Do what? Test the cannon. Me? And get myself killed? I think not. But go ahead, be my guest. I don't think I'll fit in there. That ain't my problem. According to Wick, it's a lunar cannon. Apparently, it's powerful enough to send a stick man to the moon. Oh, sure, in a Jules Verne novel, perhaps. Can I test the cannon? Be my guest. Yup, the cannon is done. I feel like sleeping for a year or two. I'll just place the hook along the bowstring, like so, and let the rope trail behind it. Okay, we're ready to fire. Can I test the cannon? Be my guest. <laughs> 